Hello everyone and welcome back to this tutorial. Today we are diving into one of the most exciting development in computer vision, semantic segmentation using SecFormer, a revolutionary transformers based architecture that's changing how we approach pixel level image understanding. In this tutorial, we are, will be working through a hands-on Jupyter notebook that demonstrates SecFormer inference step by step. If you ever wondered how AI system can identify and segment different objects in images like distinguishing between cars, trees, buildings, and people at the pixel level, then this video is perfect for you. SecFormer represents a pivotal shift in how semantic segmentation is approached, blending the global context modeling of transformer with efficiency of lightweight MLPs. Unlike traditional uh, CNN approaches, uh, SecFormer uh, introduces a clean, simple design that excels across diverse environment while being significantly more efficient than previous method. By the end of this tutorial, you will understand not just how to use SecFormer but also the underlying principle that makes it so powerful. Before we dive into code, let's understand what makes SecFormer so revolutionary and what you can accomplish with this technology so first sec former features a hierarchical transformers encoder that output multi-scale features without requiring positional encoding this is a uh, crucial be because it avoids interpolation issues that plagues other models when testing resolution differs from training resolution second the architecture uses a lightweight all MLP decoder that aggregates information from different layer combines both local attention and global attention to create powerful representation. This simple design is actually the key to SecFormer efficiency and transformer architecture. This technology has numerous real world applications like autonomous driving system uses semantic segmentation for road scene understanding, medical Imaging relies on it for organ and tissue identification. Argument reality application uses it for scene understanding and urban planning leverage it for satellite image analysis. Now let's dive into actual implementation. Let's start by setting up the environment. First, we have to install some required libraries like transformers, uh, Torch, Pillow, Matplotlib, and NumPy. Then we are going to import those modules. Now, the most important one we have to load model and image processor. Uh, I am choosing my device as CUDA if available as CPU. Then we are going to use a model called NVIDIA SecFormer B5 Fine Tune AD. ADE. This model is trained on ADE dataset, which we are going to use. Also, I have created an instance of processor and model. So the the task of processor is to resize the uh, image in our uh, model's required format and provide it to our model, which we will use to perform segmentation on our image now the the model and uh, processor is in our environment then let's prepare an image i am going to take a sample image from ade data set to test our model as you can see this image is going to be used for segmentation testing let's uh, give this image to our processor as an argument and that uh, result will be go inside our model let's visualize our result i'm going to use different color for each class so i have created a function which give me a color for each class let's run that now I will run this function as uh, as you can see the post process semantic segmentation is used this function uh, resize the image uh, from the model output to the original size which we are going to 
represent using matrix as you can see each pixel of the image has different classes like if the pixel belong to this classes all the pixel belong to this uh, that class will show same kind of uh, value but it cannot be visualized clearly so we are going to visualize it on our image as you can see this is the result of our segmentation model sec former as you can see the grass has been uh, completely green by the uh, segmentation mask there is also the mask the sky is all yellow because it belongs to same uh, same class the house is in same color as blue there is some error in segmentation as you can see it has not clearly detected uh, or understand the picture uh, we will check it using our original image let's compare with our original image this is the original segmentation mask of the image as you can see this was the original segmentation which the model hasn't quite understand but it has done a great job in understanding other classes now let's test our model on other scenarios like other images and see how well it perform to perform set former inference on images i'm going to create a function which will merge all this previous step into a single step using this function it will make our task easier to perform segmentation using sec former model now first we import our libraries then as previously explained i am going to create instance of processor and model and also provide it with the model which we are going to use which is nvidia sec former now creating the function this function uh, is uh, has a duty to take images and input and display the sec former model result on our image so as here you can see this is the part where it take image and convert into the rgb format then that image is given to processor as an argument which is used by model to convert or provide us uh, output that output is resized using post process semantic segmentation uh, which help us understanding better what uh, our image segmentation is this is the se segment map which we are getting to visualize is better we have to draw different color for each uh, classes which is done by this part of the code now this part help us in displaying our image with a segmentation mask now run this code now we are also creating a helper function which help us in downloading or a downloading or you can say showing image from internet using just url as you can see i am taking my first example let's display our example this is an image of a mountainside uh, grassland you can see th there are various class uh, classes or objects like there is a class of cow there is a class of tree there is a class of grassland and there is a class of mountains let's perform our segment uh, using seg uh, seg former as you can see it has done a good job in understanding or segment performing semantic segmentation on the image you can see the tree class is different color from the grass a grassland class and the cow class is different from other classes there's a sky part there's a mountain part now let's take another example this is a point of view of a autonomous driving vehicle so let's segment it The semantic segmentation is very perfect it has detected our truck completely which help our driving car understanding its environment better now let's take another example
this is a church uh, church image between a grass grass area there is a, a trees in the background let's perform segmentation on it as you can see the church building is completely in pink color and the grass is in green color and tree is in dark green color and the brushes of bruises of the uh, in front of church is in yellow color this helps a computer to understand what object position are now let's take another example this is a point of view of another autonomous driving vehicle which help uh, in understanding uh, what is the scenario of uh, the uh, road now perform segmentation on it as you can see it is done a great job in segmenting uh, class, car class from road class and background classes the blue part is all the car which you have to avoid during uh, uh, driving now let's take another example this is an image of a road leading to mountain let's perform segment semantic segmentation on it the result of semantic segmentation is good it can understand the road quite well and the mountain also and the side of forest is very much understandable using semantic mask now let's take another example As you can see, semantic segmentation is very good. It has understand our road quite well, which is difficult. As you can see, there is lo lots of grass and it's a muddy road. So we can understand where is grass, where is tree, where is our river. Let's, uh, with this, our tutorial on sec former inference is over. To read more, you can check our blog on SecFormer tutorial, Master Semantic Segmentation Pass. In this blog, we are going to explain how can you can perform semantic segmentation in great detail and what are the benefits of semantic segmentation in computer vision.